Welcome everybody to Clarington Kia where it's your experience your way every day online and in store and today we have a very special vehicle this is a 2017 Volkswagen e-golf comfort line what a great find this is a full electric vehicle not a plug-in hybrid this is the full deal no gasoline engine 200 kilometers of ideal range we're gonna say ideal range we'll get into that in a minute but a great vehicle with lots of amazing features beautiful condition really and just under I believe 75,000 kilometers on this so let's get into the details of this EV as well as the exterior and interior conditions so you know exactly what you're getting from us here your friends at Clarington Kia so what is powering this golf it's a hundred kilowatt motor now that doesn't sound like a lot however a let's take into consideration the size of the vehicle right it's a golf it's a tinier vehicle hatchback design Everybody loves the Golf. 134 horsepower, 214 foot-pounds of torque, 214 foot-pounds of torque in this little Golf. That's what makes EVs absolutely so much fun to drive. And all of that power really just gets transferred to those wheels almost instantaneously because it's an electric motor. And the best way I can describe that is, is think of a power drill, right? When you push the trigger on a power drill, it goes immediately from zero to 100, right? same idea with an EV. That's what you can think of when you think of electric power and that's why there's so much fun to drive. Whoops, sorry we had a technical difficulty. Okay, so what is powering this Golf? A 35.8 kilowatt hour battery pack, great size battery pack, especially considering the size of the vehicle, but that 35.8 kilowatt hours is gonna give you what they advertise of 200 kilometers of range. That's not realistic. What's realistic is about 190 kilometers of range. That's ideal range. That's at, you know, a fairly decent temperature. Now, as we get into colder months, that range will drop. However, if you precondition the battery while it's plugged in, get the car warmed up, you'll still get very close to that range. So let's say 190 kilometers of range during the summertime. And then if we get to the cold depths of winter, you might get down to like 170-ish, right? You may lose 20K um, if you uh, precondition and get everything right. But that's amazing mileage especially considering it's a 2017, right? I mean, they did things right here with this Volkswagen. Now, let's talk about some of the great features that we get aside from that amazing EV powertrain. We get LED headlights up front, LED fog lights as well. We get that nice, beautiful e-golf logo with that blue trim just over the front grill there. We have a little, little, little tiny superficial scratch right there. It's actually very light, can't catch my fingernail in it. So I think if we buff it, a lot of that will come out. Now, as we come around to the side, you can see these EV or aerodynamic alloy wheels here. The design there is to keep the air moving across the vehicle and not into those brakes because we actually don't have to heat them very much because of the regenerative braking that the EV does, which is fantastic. Brakes last so much longer on an EV than they do a traditional vehicle. As we come around to the rear, you can see we have LED taillights as well, that nice e-golf badge there. Take a step back, give you a little bit better view of the hatch. Now let's open her up, just so you can see. Definitely not lacking in space there. Lots of luggage and cargo area for your groceries, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Now on the rear bumper around the side here, I did notice, and it might be hard to see, um, again, train die, but just here, there's some really light superficial scratching, but right here, it's a little hazy. I bet you we just need to buff this. Um, so I think a lot of that will come out. Just ask us to give that a buff if you purchase this vehicle, and hopefully a lot of that will come out. Now around the passenger side, everything looks good. There was one thing that I noticed. Again, some superficial scratches just there. I mean, it's a really, really bizarre place to have a scratch. I um, can't catch a lot of it in my fingernail. So again, just a little buff under that front passenger side door. I think we'll take care all of a lot of that, but just something to note as far as the condition of the vehicle. Now, one thing that you can see here, see this white line, that's 3M protecting fill on the front hood, which is gonna keep that looking beautiful. Now on the rear, back passengers have got lots of room in the back. Seats are in fantastic condition. It does not smell. It's a non-smoker vehicle for sure. Just really nice condition in the back seats. And as we head into the front, front seats as well are in great shape. 
no rips, tears, stains, or burns anywhere in this Golf. Now we have a power backrest as far as your tilt, height adjustable seat, all kind of the normal stuff. Surprised that it's just a power adjustable backrest, not the whole seat, but nonetheless, here we are. All right, so let's get it started up. All right, so weird, right? You wait for kind of that engine to kind of kick in, but there's no engine, there's just a motor. So looking at the front, 188 kilometers range right now is what it's saying. So that gives you kind of an idea of the maximum range that we have right now. And our battery is more or less full. So give or take two kilometers, 190, 195. However you drive this, you can really kind of maximize that range. But if you want to use all 214 feet pounds of torque, that range will go down quicker. So you choose how you want to drive it. Um, we've got our cruise control, volume control here. We've got our controls for the center display right here and the radio as well. You can kind of go through that. It doesn't really show you a whole lot of information in the center, which is nice. And the other thing that I like is here, this gauge here, which shows you whether regenerative braking or charging or using your power, isn't anything really distracting. And that is important when you're in EV. You don't want range anxiety. You want things flashing at you, telling you if you're getting lower on range, you know what 188 kilometers is. You know if that fits your, your commute that day. So we don't need to attract a whole lot of attention to it. So I like that VW did that. That was really smart forward thinking. Moving over here, let's get out of this screen here. So we do have a really nice AM, FM, XM satellite radio. We have Bluetooth audio streaming, but most importantly, we do have, if I can find it, apps, Android Auto and Apple CarPlay. So connect your phone via USB, and then you're gonna have Basically, this whole screen turns into more or less like your phone. You're going to be able to reply back to text messages with your voice, use Spotify, use Waze, use all your stuff that you have on your cell phone. We've got your dual zone climate control. We have heated seats as well. Uh, this Volkswagen e-Golf does use a heat pump, uh, which is obviously going to save you a ton of energy as far as uh, keeping the EV warm, which is really nice news some junk storage down here. If you're wondering why this is so glitchy right now, this video, I'm having such problems with my phone, so I apologize. But anyway, ah, start stop button, mode for eco, eco plus or normal driving mode, uh, depending on how conservative you wanna be that day. We've got a tiptronic shifter, and this is where you can actually change how the regenerative braking works as you're driving just by tapping it down. Um, essentially what it's gonna do is adjust how, I guess, aggressive the regen works, which is how it applies the braking power reverses that puts it back into power. So uh, that's really cool that they, you can do that and change that kind of on the fly as you drive to get a nice feel or maximum range. Now we've got your cup holders here kind of hidden away, electronic parking brake, USB plug, and then of course our center armrest. Um, nice interior, nice interior trim, really super clean in this vehicle, of course. And I'm gonna jump out and try to wrap this up because, um, oh, before I do that, Carfax. Low kilometers, no reported accidents, 2017 e-Golf. That's exactly everything you wanna see there, just a no accident vehicle. But I apologize for the rush, but this is a fantastic car, complete EV, almost 200 kilometers of ideal range. If you're looking to absolutely save a ton of money, this is a fantastic choice, and it's right here at Clarington Kia. Low maintenance, no fuel, great condition, fantastic price. Oh, love it. Come down here, buy this car. I don't suspect this will be here for long. If you're watching, this might already be too late, but if it's on our website at clarentakia.ca, it is available. So either leave a deposit on there and complete your transaction on completely online or come drive speed here and take this out for yourself and then complete your transaction at clarentakia. Either way, your experience, your way. Apologize for the rest video, but what a great find. You shouldn't need to see any more than this. All right, guys, take care. Have a great day.